For the fifth consecutive year, the city of Coral Gables celebrated successfully another International Parking Day. Well, it's just really wonderful to be outside and enjoy the outdoors, get some nice sun. Like, a lot of the times, most of us are inside working. Being reminded to have a very walkable urban community is, is nice because it, it allows us to relax and refresh and just enjoy. Uh, this is the fifth year in a row that we've been celebrating Parking Day. As you said, it's an international event and really uh, showing the public how we can transform uh, par uh, public parking spaces into public parks. Uh, something that we in the city are very big on is green space and this is a great event to be able to help celebrate that. So this is our Coral Gables, uh, our City of Coral Gables site where we've uh, taken some parking spaces in front of Coral Gables City Hall and we've converted it into a, a mini sp uh, space where people can come, enjoy their lunch, uh, hang out. I'm having lunch. Uh, I work in Coral Gables. I think there should be more outdoor seating areas with, uh, you know, tables. On the third Friday of the month of September, nearly 140 cities around the world transform parking spaces into green open areas for the enjoyment of pedestrians. This year, several businesses in downtown Coral Gables participated of this event. Capital One Cafe on Miracle Mile set up tables and chairs where people enjoyed lunch and played dominoes. I think it's good and I think it looks very well. It's so funny for the people, like uh, entertainment today, one day special like today, and the people coming to the bank and found something like this. Graciano's restaurant featured a very nice green area where people mingled and relaxed. The vision that I had was to have a nice outdoor area so people can relax and lounge. It's to bring people together, they can come and they eat outside and, you know, sit on the couch and have some wine. If you're interested in participating of International Parking Day celebrations for 2020, visit the city's webpage at coralgables.com. Best of all, businesses don't have to pay anything to participate. They just need creativity to transform a parking space into something beautiful like this. Reporting for Cora Gables Television, I'm Diana Herrera.